Mario, Scott, Julio, Jose, Hayden. Go ahead and get everybody nice and bunched up. Go ahead and roll them, keep them rolling, roll them. Nice and easy. All right, Luke is going to go live in three, two. Luke is live. Your A main of open buggy. 15 minute main event under the lights here at TMC. A couple drivers getting a little bit long over the step down. Oh no, and it looks like somebody having a flame out. Is that Peyton? And I didn't quite see what happened, but it looks like Stober got it a little bit wrong, collected Kyle. They're back to the two and four position. Tommy getting a little bit wonky over the step up. Kyle Adolph going way off track. He makes it back on safely. Him and Scott Bates over the left hand double. They are going wheel to wheel. And it does look like Mario Rudy from that number three position gonna go all the way up to the point. Stober down to the two, Kyle to the three. Jose in the four, Scott in the five. Julio rounded out your field. Looks like Payton's refired him back on track. Stober getting in a little bit wrong. That's gonna allow Kyle to move up into that number two position. He's gonna see if he can run down Mario. He's keeping that techno buggy nice and tight lined. Stober doing a little durability test. Getting in slightly wrong over that center double. But it is still going to be Mario Rudy. He's in that number one position. Kyle Adolph in the two. Tom Stober in that number three. The leaders running Techno Techno Kiyosho. Sanchez up for that number four. He's running that TLR ride. Scott Banton in that five with the Associated. I do believe Payton's out there still with his HB. Got all sorts of cars out on track. This is your leader, Peyton, coming up on you. I do know it is early in this race, but if he does get up on you, please let him by. Kyle Adolph starting to close down that gap on Mario Rudy, though. They're only separated by eight tenths of a second at the line. Stober 6.2 back from that battle. Kyle doing everything he can. They collect each other. Kyle Adolph going to be the gentleman and keep the give him the position. Allows Stober to make up some of that gap. He gets it a little bit wrong over the step down. But your battle on track still Mario and Kyle. Mario's going short. Kyle sending it. He clips the pipe, gets up on two wheels. Mario going wide. Kyle going narrow. They're on this left-hand side into the ropes. Everybody going double, double, double. Those whoops will bite you, but it is Techno v. Techno, separated by one second as they rip down the straightaway. Still been making up a ton of time on that last lap. He made up 3.1 seconds on your second position of Kyle Adolf. Looks like Adolf getting around. He's moved up to that number one position. Mario Rudy dropped down to that number two. This track is biting people, definitely giving us some character as we are just now at that 3.30 mark, 11.30 still to go. Mario Rudy getting a little bit long over that baby tabletop. It's going to allow Stober to close in. Looks like they're separated by about a second as they go to the left-hand tabletop. <laughs> Kyle's transponder is not clicking. Never mind. Good call, Adam. I suck. My bad. I RD like I race, okay? Sometimes I work, sometimes I don't. That is Peyton getting a little bit wrong over the center double. And I do believe, does that move Tom Stover up to the point? Kiyosho himself? Mr. 10 Minute Runtime? Both those guys jumping onto the inside. Mario is trying not to let him out of his position. Keep it calm. They both jump that center. Considering they both did it, I will not call them. But let's try not to cut that center. Whoop section. 
Marshall on straightaway there is Peyton getting a little bit wrong, collecting Kyle. Oh no, Peyton flaming out on that center straightaway. But the battle is on for that one and two position. They both go over the right hand step up. Both of those buggies looking a little loose. Everybody throwing rooster tails. Stober getting a little bit short. Mario greasing it. Stober getting flipped around. Oh no, and Mario durability testing on a pipe. Gonna allow Stober to keep that position. But these two are trading mistakes. No one can get away from each other. With 5.30 down, 9.30 left to go. Come on, Kyle, pull it. Your one and two position, they're separated by about half a second on track. Your number three, he's back about nine seconds. Six minutes down, nine minutes left to go. We may see some long fuel strategies, some short fuel strategies. But it is still that battle for that one and two position. They rip down the straightaway. Tom Stover, Mario Rudy. Techno versus Kiyosho. Rudy looks to the inside. Oh, he's being a kind gentleman. They are bumping and rubbing. Get him, Mario. Oh, and Stover going for a car wheel ride. That's going to give Mario some nice breathing room. Let's see if he can keep it clean and consistent and on all fours. This track has got some good old character. And everybody jumping to the inside of that center step up. That's going to Tom Stover flipping back over. Mario Rudy with a large, large lead now. Looks like he's going to have about five seconds on Stover. Kyle Adolph nowhere near to capitalize on those mistakes. Those look like Jose Sanchez and Scott Banta. They're both having the battle. They're down there simply in that four and five position. I cannot see who that was. It looks like it was Scott getting a little bit wrong. Scott, that is your leader. Thank you, sir. I will call Jose as well. Jose, your next car coming up on you will be your leader. That white, yellow wing, techno buggy. That number two position coming behind you guys. And I did not see who was that your leader getting it wrong? No, that looks like that was Jose. So it is still Mario Rudy holding down that number one position. He's coming in for fuel. We are just at that 7.45 mark, seven minutes left to go. Stober running his hot lap of the race and the, yes, his hot lap of the race with the 44.6. Looks like eight offense in that number three position. He's down in a way. Let's see what happens. Marshall in the center. Marshall, 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 center, center. Marshall, center. Thank you, Garrett. Peyton holding that thing wide open. Let's see what happens here as uh, Stover comes around. See if he holds out for another lap. He is staying out for another lap. He, he is known for having some of the greatest fuel mileage on one of the biggest tracks. Stover getting it a little bit wrong on that right-hand side. He jumps outside of the track. Going to allow that number two position of Mario Rudy to close back in. If he can get back in front of him before this fuel stop, that will be impressive. Faith, that is your number two position right behind you. Please, whenever you get the chance. Thank you, sir. Oh, uh, no, and it looks like you got another flame out. Oh. Rough day for the Peyton man himself. 9.15 down, 5.45 still to go. Tom Stover looks like he's trying to come into pit lane. He catches the pipe. That is going to offer a nice long fuel stop. That is going to give Mario Rudy a huge amount of breathing room. All he needs to do is keep it clean and consistent for the next 
five minutes and 30 seconds, and he will take the round number three open buggy point series race. Tom Stover's in that there, 51-5. Definitely not the way you want to do it. Mario Rudy trying to take out a Chris's book. He's throwing front flips over the double. But let's see what happens here. We are in the final stages of this race. Both of them have fuel stops. Do you believe it is Kyle Adolf still out there circulating in that number three position? But that battle for the number one position separated by 5.3 seconds. Oh no, and Mario getting flipped over. Marshall right there to get him. That's going to allow Stober to come close. Take a breather. No need to push the issue. Couple mistakes. Move Stober right back onto the back door. These guys are wanting a battle and they're getting one. Stober going car wheeling. Everybody durability testing their vehicles. Sad day for Peyton walking off the stand. Wicked fast driver. Him and Kyle had a great run at the truck race last weekend out at Adobe. That gap is down to 2.6 seconds as they both go down the right-hand side of the track. Mario through the staircase, Stover through the staircase. Getting a little bit spicy on the trigger, going wide. Both of those guys making it cleanly up the step up this time. This battle is going to come down to these final laps. Mario jumping to the inside. He gets it a little bit wrong on the inside. No, Garrett right there to get him. Oh, Garrett, nice and easy, nice and easy. Thank you, sir, for the effort. We appreciate that. Marshall, please watch your ankles. Tony does not want a lawsuit. That will move Tom Stover back up in that number one position. That mistake cost in Rudy 5.3 seconds. Thank you, sir. Traffic knows that lovely orange paint scheme, Tom Stover. Scott Banty getting a little bit wrong, coming on her straight away. She's holding her wide open. 2.30 left to go, drivers. 2.30 left. Kyle Adolf still out there circulating laps. He's had a lonely number three position on track. Two minutes left. You heard him, drivers. Two minutes left. Stover putting in the hot lap of the race on that last lap with a 44 flat. With a minute 30 left to go, Stover clicking off another one. Looks like Mario having a little bit of rough time on that left-hand side of the track. Let's see if this allows Kyle to close in at all. That gap was 21 seconds, but after those couple mistakes, let's see what happens. That's now down to 15.9 seconds on track. With a minute left, these drivers are going to get two more laps. One minute left. If you guys do see that orange buggy of Tom Stover, please give him a little bit of extra room. He is a profession now. Give him a buggy whip. He will take it. No need to pull over and stop. Peyton, <laughs> what the? Peyton going upside down. Stover somehow threading the needle. Pretty sure Peyton has that throttle trigger at wide open or close shut. Got to flame out on the right-hand side of the track. Flame out on the right-hand side of the track. 
and it's Peyton flaming again. I feel you, buddy. That was my last weekend. Ten seconds left here. Looks like Tom Stover. He's going to go around for a victory lap with five seconds left. Four, three, two, one. And that is time. When you hear your name, you are done. Tom Stover on his victory lap. Mr. Fuel Mileage, Mr. Kiyosho, the unbeaten man of the TNC. Mario Rudy done. Mario Rudy.